Hi guys, my name is Daniela and today we're going to be talking about ways to make your curls tighter and train them to become more springy, bouncy curls. So, for the past three years, I haven't like used heat on my hair, I haven't straightened it and this has truly been one of the biggest things ever. Stop straightening your hair, like stop using heat, like blow drying, even like blow drying your curls, stop doing that, like you do not need heat and I find that when I air dry my hair is so much better, like actually before I thought when I diffuse my, my curls it's so much more voluptuous and so nice. But when I just started to air dry it, I found that it was so much better. My results were so much better from air drying. So if you are interested in videos like this, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe down below. I will really appreciate your support. So one thing you can do to achieve more tighter curls is to get regular cuts. Now it's so important because your natural hair is so curly and like beautiful but the problem is the environment and us styling our hair the wrong way us using bad products all of this stuff is what's calling your hair to fall straight to be a little weak um, to just be straggly curls so literally go on to Amazon I'll put a link down below and buy yourself a good pair of hair cutting scissors and trim your hair when you see now and again there's fit ends or there's like knots on the ends of your strands like literally cut your hair like as you need because it is so important for your hair to grow back healthy because also if you don't cut off the dead ends literally your hair won't spring up because it's weighed down by all this like heavy weight so definitely cut that shit off like cut it off like you need to be wearing protective hairstyles so deep condition your hair because it's so important for your hair to absorb the moisture and become curlier then what you need to do is put your hair up in braids bantu knots I can put it in a bonnet anything you can do is just get it out of your face and protect it from the environment use oilaplex use oilaplex and I will leave a link down below make sure you use protein based curly hair products now this is going to give your hair enough structure to form a curl avoid parabens avoid sulfates avoid anything chemically damaging to your hair and make sure you stick to all natural products baby get a brush with bristles and a lot of bristles that create tension in your hair but when you use a brush with tension it allows the curl to form make sure you're putting the right stuff in your body taking your vitamins drinking your water right drinking your water and eating fruits and vegetables like literally because everything from the inside will reflect on the outside so drink water use a natural products I swear to you like if you just if you look at all the products that you have and you go for natural solutions find good hair products that are natural my favorite oil right now is the Morpho Cosmetics growth hair oil I love this oil so much because it helps me with thinning bolding split ends and just to keep my hair moisturized um, this is definitely a must-have product. I will link my website down below Like I swear to you guys like if you do these steps religiously like deep condition your hair eat good food Constantly wash and moisturize your hair put moisture back in with deep conditioning do regular cuts take your vitamins use more protein Know the difference between protein and moisture so you know when you need certain proteins and certain moisturizing ingredients. Okay, so the next thing you can do to train your curls to become more curly is to literally finger coil them. Like at the beginning, you won't notice a difference, but when you stick to it, like consistency matters so much. Like stick to finger coiling and you will see, like you will literally see your shape of your curls will start to naturally fall in that way because it's so used to falling in that way it's like when you constantly straighten your hair your hair just becomes dead because of the heat and also it's just so used to falling straight that it just automatically becomes straight so start doing that with your curls like literally take some products make sure you have like good moisturizing products all natural ingredients of course and um, literally finger call your hair and train it to move in that specific direction use the correct brush for your hair type now there are different brushes for your hair type I'm just gonna show you guys my hair 
I'm so obsessed with my hair right now. I did cut it, which is a big regret. <laughs> Even though I am encouraging you to cut your hair. I cut it because I was like low-key bored and just wanting like more layers. But I cut too much off. Like, and I couldn't go back from that point. So I was like, oh, I guess we're back to a big chop. Not really, but like a little bit. Um, so yeah. My hair grows so fast because of all of the stuff that I've been doing. So guys, like take this stuff seriously. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button down below and subscribe.